Miniature Schnauzers are adorable little dogs. They are a popular breed among dog lovers, but despite their small size, they have a big personality and a unique way of communicating. Understanding a miniature Schnauzer's canine language is key to building a strong bond with these furry friends. In this article, we will explore the different ways in which these dogs communicate and how you can better understand their needs and emotions. Point one of the most common ways miniature Schnauzers communicate is through body language. Paying attention to their body posture, facial expressions, and tail movements can provide valuable insights into their current state. For example, a relaxed body with a loose wagging tail indicates a happy and contented pup. On the other hand, a stiff body with a raised tail signifies alertness or even aggression. Another important aspect of miniature schnauzer communication is vocalization. These dogs tend to be very vocal and express themselves through barks, growls, and howls. While barking is natural for dogs, understanding the different types of barks can help decipher their message. A high-pitched bark accompanied by jumping and running in circles may indicate excitement or playfulness, while a deep, loud bark with a rigid stance could be a sign of protection or warning. Miniature schnauzers are known for their expressive faces. Their eyebrows and mustaches give them a unique and comical appearance. But these features also play a role in their communication. These dogs can raise their eyebrows to convey surprise or curiosity. They may also scrunch up their nose or show their teeth as a sign of aggression or discomfort. It's crucial to pay attention to these subtle facial cues to understand what your furry friend is trying to tell you. Tail wagging is often associated with happiness, but it can also indicate other emotions. A slow wag with a low tail may imply fear or uncertainty, while a rapid wag with a held up tail reflects excitement or joy. Keep in mind that tail wagging should be observed in conjunction with other body language cues to accurately interpret your miniature schnauzer's emotions. Apart from body language and vocalization, miniature schnauzers also communicate through gestures. They may nudge you with their nose, paw at your leg, or even tap you with their paw to get your attention or demand something. It's essential to respond to these gestures appropriately to foster a healthy line of communication with your furry companion. Understanding your miniature schnauzer's canine language isn't just about decoding their messages, it's also about responding effectively and appropriately. When your pup barks out of excitement, engaging in play or giving them a toy can help release their energy in a positive way. On the other hand, if they bark out of fear or aggression, it's crucial to approach the situation calmly and provide reassurance. Additionally, giving your miniature schnauzer enough exercise and mental stimulation can also improve their communication skills. A tired and stimulated dog is more likely to communicate effectively and exhibit balanced behavior. Engaging in regular playtime, training sessions, and puzzle toys can go a long way in keeping your furry friend mentally and physically healthy. Lastly, it's important to remember that each miniature schnauzer is unique and they may have their own individual communication styles. Spending quality time with your pup, observing their behavior, and being attuned to their needs will help you build a strong bond and understanding. Dot in conclusion, miniature schnauzers have their own unique canine language, which includes body language, vocalization, facial expressions, tail wagging, and gestures. Understanding these communication cues is essential in building a strong relationship with your furry friend. By paying attention to their body posture, barks, facial expressions, and tail movements, you can better understand their needs and emotions. Responding appropriately and providing adequate exercise and mental stimulation are key factors in effective communication. So, take the time to study their language.